exclusive contracted novel by Felu Novel Network. I, Fahai, start with the powerful Tian Long, suppress the martial arts world, crossing the world of martial arts and becoming the senior brother of Shaolin, he started by winning the title of Wan Wan and gaining the inheritance of the La Si. Arhat's Golden Body Immortality is like a mountain, which can intimidate the world. The golden body cannot be destroyed, and it can be reborn with blood dripping. The Great Heavenly Dragon Classic Carrying the heavenly dragon, crushing the mountains and seas with strength, the dragon's power is like a prison, warding off evil spirits. From then on, a violent monk entered the martial arts world, sparking a bloody reign. Felu Novel Network reminds you that this novel and its characters are purely fictional. If there are any similarities, they are purely coincidental and should not be imitated. Chapter 001 Shaolin Disciple, Fahai You are listening at NovelFull.audio Under Shaoshir Mountain I saw a young man about fifteen years old, dressed in a unique monk robe of Shaolin Temple Disciples, swaying back towards Shaoshir Mountain. This young man, commonly known as Chen Yang, has the Dharma name, Fahai. Of course, he also has one identity, which is a traveler from Earth. Three years ago, Chen Yang was exploring Shenangjia and accidentally discovered a cave. He obtained a fragment inside, but when he came out, he accidentally stepped on it and fell under the cliff. When he woke up again, he found himself crossing over. Travel to a world of great martial arts. This world blends all the martial arts novels of Jin, Gu, Huang, Liang, and Wen. He once dreamed of becoming a hero. Now that the heavens have given him a chance, he is naturally happy, but the next moment, Chen Yang is struck by his own identity. His new identity in this world is actually an ordinary disciple of Shaolin Temple. Hey! Chen Yang let out a sigh. And this time he left Shaoshir Mountain to go to Wudong for his master and deliver a letter to Song Yuanxiao, one of the seven heroes of Wudong. This is also the first time in three years that he has left Shaoshir Mountain in this world. Suddenly, Chen Yang stopped because he heard a fighting sound coming from not far away. Go take a look. Chen Yang thought to himself that he had not yet seen scenes of people fighting in the martial arts world. Quickly, he arrived at the place where the book was being published and found four big men besieging a young girl. Sleeping slot. Fairy. Chen Yang saw the girl's appearance and his eyes lit up. After all, all he had seen in Shaolin Temple for the past three years were bald monks of the same color. Boom. In the midst of a fight. Since the young girl suppressed the besieged four with the power of one person. Innate expert. Chen Yang also showed a surprised expression when he saw the faint aura emanating from the girl's body. You should know that when he came to this world, he naturally worked hard to cultivate, but after three years of cultivation, he was only barely able to step into the early days after birth. But now this girl, looking at the years, should be similar to him, but her strength is innate, and the difference is really a bit big. Which, you have been poisoned. Please surrender quickly. The leader looked at the girl and said coldly. At the same time, I also wondered why the poison on her body had not yet broken out. You should know that the poison claimed to even exist in the realm of heaven and humanity could be poisoned. Humph. The girl snorted coldly, but her body was out of control, and the poison in her body was slowly erupting. Do you want to take action? Chen Yang, who was hiding not far away, naturally heard what the big man said, but if he acted, he would definitely not be a match for that person, after all, the leader was an innate expert. But if we don't take action, will we just see such a beautiful woman fade away? Chen Yang naturally refused. By the way, Chen Yang suddenly looked into his bag, maybe that thing could be used. Amitba Buddha. Please stop, benefactors. Dot. Just as they were about to meet again, a Buddha's voice rang in their ears. In an instant, they all stopped. They know that this place is not far from Shaolin Temple. 
Soon, they saw a young man wearing a monk's robe walking out one after another. Little monk. After seeing Chen Yang, those big men breathed a sigh of relief. They thought it was a master from Shaolin Temple, just a little monk. They couldn't stir up any waves. Several benefactors, this is the land of Buddhism. Please do not engage in mass killings again, Chen Yang said with a compassionate expression on his face. Damn it, a little monk dares to talk nonsense and seek death, one of them shouted, and then quickly came towards Chen Yang. Amitba Buddha, since the benefactor is obsessed and unable to comprehend, I can only send you to the western paradise. The next moment, Chen Yang saw two small black ball balls in his hand and threw them towards where. Fourth brother, be careful. The leader was also shocked when he saw the small ball thrown by Chen Yang. Surprisingly, it thundered like thunder. It was a treasure that could even be killed if the master didn't pay attention. Bang! The explosion sounded. That person was directly blown open. Fourth brother. The three people shouted when they saw the dead person. But the girl was shocked. Is this little monk really a Shaolin disciple? Aren't all Shaolin disciples compassionate? But this person. What else are you looking at? Let's go. Chen Yang went straight to the girl's side, hugged her, and then left this place directly. This thunderbolt was used by his master to protect his life. There is only one, and once used up, there will be none. So while the three of them haven't reacted yet, naturally they should hurry and run away. Chapter 002 The Wei Tianlong You are listening at NovelFull.audio When the three of them reacted, Chen Yang had already taken the girl to a hidden cave. You let go of me. The girl looked at Chen Yang holding her in her arms, her face turning red. This was the first time she had been approached so closely by a man. Chen Yang reacted and quickly let go, but it has to be said that this little girl has a good figure. Sorry, female benefactor. I had no choice but to do so just now, Chen Yang quickly explained. The girl was about to speak when she suddenly felt the suppressed toxicity of her body explode, and her entire body couldn't help but fall. Chen Yang, with quick eyes and quick hands, hugged the girl who was about to fall again and quickly asked, female benefactor, are you okay? The next second, the girl hugged her with both hands and then gave her a small mouth. Lying trough. This is not being poisoned by seduction, is it? Chen Yang thought of it. What should we do? Forget it. Saving a person's life is better than building a level 7 pagoda. Who goes to hell if I don't go to hell? With such thoughts in mind, Chen Yang also took advantage of the situation. That's it. One night passed. Early morning. The girl woke up and came over. A bright red blush appeared on the ground. Are you awake? Chen Yang looked at the girl who had woken up and didn't know what to say. It's not what I thought, you did it yourself. I did it to save you. The girl didn't speak, but quietly looked at Chen Yang. After a while, she asked, What's your name? As he said, Without him, perhaps I had already died from poisoning. My name is Chen Yang, Chen Yang said. Chen Yang, remember not to let outsiders know today, otherwise, even at the ends of the earth, I, Wan Wan, will pursue you. The girl spoke fiercely and then left the cave, leaving Chen Yang with a bewildered expression on his face. Wan Wan. I'll wipe it. I actually slept with the witch Wan Wan from the Yin Kue sect. Wan Wan. This is one of the female protagonists in the twin dragons of the Tang dynasty. Ding. Congratulations to the master for breaking the precept successfully. The system wakes up. Dot. At this moment. A voice rang out in Chen Yang's mind. Golden finger. Finally launched. Chen Yang was naturally shocked when he heard this sound. Sure enough, all the travelers have golden fingers. When Chen Yang arrived in this world, he was thinking about why he didn't have a golden finger. 
It turned out that he didn't have one, it was just that the conditions he triggered were incorrect. Ding! Congratulations to the master for breaking the precepts for the first time and obtaining a mysterious inheritance. Is it enabled? Open. Chen Yang replied. At the same time. I am also looking forward to what inheritance I can obtain. Congratulations to the master for obtaining the inheritance of the Dharma Sea. Congratulations to the master for obtaining the great heavenly dragon technique. Congratulations to the master for obtaining the nine rings tin staff. Congratulations to the master for obtaining the infinite cassock. Congratulations to the master for obtaining the Tianlong tattoo. Congratulations to the master for obtaining a golden bowl. Dot. Sleeping slot. Fahai. Chen Yang heard the information prompted by the system and surprisingly obtained the inheritance of Fahai. Fahai is a character from the legend of the White Snake. The next moment. A huge divine dragon tattoo appeared on Chen Yang's body, with the dragon head on his chest and an over-shoulder dragon. At the same time, a powerful energy surged into oneself. Chen Yang quickly activated the great heavenly dragon technique to absorb the energy that appeared in his body. That's it. After three days. Boom. A powerful aura erupted from inside the cave. Congenital. Chen Yang opened his eyes. With the blessing of that aura, he broke through all the way from the early days after birth to the early innate stage in one breath. Although it is only in its early innate stage, his true combat power, even if it is innate perfection, will fall here. And there are also three treasures. Cassock, Tin Staff, Golden Bowl. These three treasures are true immortals, but now he is completely unable to unleash their power. Three drops of fresh blood fell, and three treasures entered the body. Then, as Chen Yang thought in his heart, an ordinary monk robe and an ordinary tin rod appeared on his body and in his hand. As for his golden finger, it stopped ringing after he woke up. We can only explore slowly. Then I took a look at the cave. Wan Wan, please wait for me. I got into bed and still want to leave. Nowadays, Chen Yang's confidence has skyrocketed, after all, he carries the legacy of the Dharma Sea and has a golden finger in his body. Chapter 003 Dali, Duan Yu, Met Little Master Fahai You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chen Yang left the cave with strong confidence and continued his journey towards Wudang. Nowadays, with divine skills in hand and divine tools by his side, there is no place in the world where Chen Yang dare not go. But the task assigned by the master still needs to be completed well. As for Wan Wan Chen Yang remembered the passion of that night. That wonderful feeling fills Chen Yang's heart at the thought of it. I'll see you again in the future, Wan Wan. Three days later. That day, Chen Yang came to a small town. For the first time walking for such a long time, it was tiring to run around all the way, and every day I had to eat dry food. Chen Yang felt like a bird was fading out of his mouth. As soon as you enter the small town, go straight to the restaurant inside the town. Today we need to have a good tooth ceremony. The bartender saw a guest coming and was very discerning. He quickly greeted them. Guest. Little master, please come inside. The waiter glanced at Chen Yang's shiny forehead and the robe on his body. The guest in his mouth quickly changed to a young master. This waiter is quite clever. The vegetarian dishes in our store are excellent. You can have me introduce and introduce them to the young master later. The waiter is quite knowledgeable. As for monks, they naturally have to be vegetarian. The child, with a smiling face and a bow, humbly took the initiative to lead the way. After all, Shaolin Temple is a well-known martial arts sect in the world of martial arts. A mere bartender in a tavern, although there are also martial arts sects as backers behind it. But compared to Shaolin Temple, that's the difference between fireflies and the moon. But it cannot be compared at all. For a waiter, he is a big shot, 
but he cannot offend anyone at all. I found a seat by the window and Chen Yang sat down. Our chef used to work in a big restaurant for over a decade. Other kids dare not boast in front of the young master. Just talking about this dish, it's a masterpiece in this area of dozens of miles. Those who have eaten are all agreed upon. The waiter proudly stood up with big thumbs up. Especially the maple tofu, which is hot, spicy, smooth and tender, is delicious. And there are also stir-fried oats and vegetables, shredded potatoes in vinegar sauce. Stop. Watching the chattering waiter, Chen Yang quickly called a halt. What vegetarian dishes to eat, bring me good wine and meat. After eating vegetarian dishes for three years, they finally come out and still eat them. Nowadays, Chen Yang naturally wants to eat meat well. Yes, yes, give grandpa good wine and meat. The waiter's subconscious greeting. Ah. The waiter was shocked. I didn't have any ear problems, did I? Did you experience hallucinations because you didn't sleep well last night? Monk, shouldn't you be a vegetarian? Why is this monk eating meat and drinking alcohol? Little master, yes. Do you want to eat meat or drink alcohol? The waiter couldn't believe it and confirmed it again. Why, can't I eat it, or are you afraid I won't be able to afford the silver? Here you are. Chen Yang slapped a ingot of silver onto the table. I can't do without you. No, no, it's just a little clumsy and ignorant. Don't be angry, sir. The waiter quickly apologized. I'll prepare good wine and meat for you, young master. Speaking, the waiter collected the money and quickly went down. Today, the waiter also broadened his horizons. The first time I saw a monk in public, he casually said he wanted to drink and eat meat. Such blatant boldness. Even if you want to eat, you have to hide some. Are you not afraid of Buddha blaming you? Isn't it a fake monk? This commotion has attracted the attention of diners nearby. But upon hearing that this little monk belongs to Shaolin Temple, he dare not meddle in his affairs. They all lowered their heads and pretended not to see. Chen Yang was also happy to be idle and indifferent to the gaze of others. They are all small characters, and Chen Yangxi is not at all panicked. After the waiter left, a short while passed. A young man appeared by Chen Yang's side. Could you please share a table, young master? Originally, that waiter was not really boasting. He was built in this small town and really famous. Nowadays, it's time for meals, and the sizable restaurants are already overcrowded. Chen Yang looked around and found that there were indeed no seats left. Sure. Chen Yang had no choice but to nod. The young man was overjoyed and quickly sat down. Oh my, there's already a spot available. Thank you, young master. If it weren't for the young master, I wouldn't have known when I would have waited. I don't know where the young master practices. Chen Yang looked up and down at the young man. I saw him with a jade crown on his face, a tall and upright posture, and an extraordinary temperament. He was dressed in a white robe, and his accessories were of great value. Well, like a young master from a wealthy family. However, looking at this expression, why does it feel a bit silly? Shaoshir Mountain, Fahai. Chen Yang clasped his hands together and bowed. The young man's eyes lit up when he heard that he was from Shaolin Temple. Quickly respond with a bow. Originally a disciple of Shaolin Temple, disrespectful and disrespectful. No one in the world knows that Shaoshu Mountain is the holy land of Shaolin Temple. I don't know if your excellency is. Chen Yang is also curious about this person's identity. From the appearance, this person should not be an ordinary person. In Dali, Duanyu, I have met Little Master Fahai. Chapter 004 Wine and meat passing through the intestine, left in the heart of the Buddha. You are listening at NovelFull.audio. What? Duanyu. Chen Yang suddenly heard the name, which also shook his heart. 
this product is actually Duan Yu. The protagonist in the Tianlong Babu, the son of the proper fortune. No wonder it feels silly. So it's your kid. Chen Yang feels like he's really here this time. Just a few days down the mountain, I saw two famous people. And also had a deep relationship with one of them. This is really not open for three years, but only a few have opened. Not bad, not bad. And just when Chen Yang wanted to have a deep exchange with Duan Yu, the waiter came up with the food. Four dishes and one soup, four meat dishes and one meat soup. Add a pot of top dot quality daughter red. It's really good wine and meat. MMM Chen Yang took a deep breath. Fragrance. Long time no see. Chen Yang has been eating vegetarian food in the temple for three years. I can finally have a big feast today. The chef's skills in this restaurant are really good. Just smell this fragrance, you can't be wrong. Brother Duan came at the right time. Come on, don't be polite. Brother Duan and I also had a chance to meet here. I'll treat you to this meal today. Duan Yu looked at Chen Yang, who looked intoxicated, but was dumbfounded. This is both wine and meat. Is this really a monk? Isn't it true that monks practice fasting and are vegetarians? Are you not afraid of breaking the precepts? Isn't it a fake monk? Little master, this is. Seeing Duan Yu's shocked expression, Chen Yang's heart was moved. Please tease this silly guy this time. Hurry up and pretend to be regretful. With a solemn expression on his face, he clasped his hands together and chanted the Buddha's name. Amitba Buddha, sin is sin. I am truly guilty. If it weren't for the benefactor's reminder, I would have broken the precepts. Seeing Chen Yang Xinxing, I really have a bit of a precious and dignified appearance, like a Taoist monk. Duan Yu was suddenly intimidated. I took a deep breath. Oh, I didn't know, did I? But on second thought, where is there a monk who doesn't know how to fast? Seeing Duan Yu's silly face. Chen Yang laughed heartily. Duan Yu actually took it seriously. Haha, <laughs> brother Duan, you're really laughing at me. Then Chen Yang restrained his smile and got serious. There is a saying that wine and meat pass through the intestines, leaving a lasting impression in the Buddha's heart. Do I drink and eat meat, which hinders me from worshipping the Buddha? Does it hinder me from doing good deeds and helping others? On the contrary, some monks do not eat meat or drink alcohol. But, deceiving people for money, not engaging in production, indulging in extravagance and debauchery, having fertile fields and fields, and having wives, concubines, and servants in groups. If Buddha had a spirit, you would say he would recognize that kind of person. Buddha is seeking in the heart, not outside. Moreover, the earliest Buddhists ate meat and vegetables. Think about it, at first, monks relied on begging for alms to make a living. Can you still choose when making a fortune? Isn't that what the host gave to eat? Does the master only have one bowl of meat for you? You said I fast, but I don't eat it. This is not about becoming a monk, I'm afraid it's just like collecting taxes from an official. Not eating meat and drinking alcohol is just an imposition imposed by later generations, just causing trouble for others. As long as there is a Buddha in the heart, drinking and eating meat, what's the point? Chen Yang's rambling words confused Duan Yu. Stuck on the spot. Is it really like this? Duan Yu felt his values being fiercely pressed and rubbed against the ground. Chen Yang didn't disturb either. He picked up his chopsticks with a smile and ate them in big gulps. Fragrance it can be considered eating meat. Pick up the wine and pour yourself a full glass. Shit. Great. There is wine and meat, this is life. Duan Yu slowly regained his senses. Watching Chen Yang wolf down, Duan Yu stood up and grabbed him to the end. Little master, Duan Yu has been taught. Thank you very much, little master. Chen Yang bowed back. There's nothing to do, it's just some nonsense. 
I can't be considered a big gift from Brother Duan. Come and eat quickly. The meat and vegetables cooked in this restaurant are really delicious. If you don't eat it anymore, if it gets cold, the taste won't be right. This dish will only taste right when it's just out of the pot. Duan Yu grinned. This little master is really a wonderful person. Interesting, it's really interesting. Duan Yu suddenly became interested in Qin Yang. Okay, then I'm not polite. After speaking, he picked up a large piece of meat with chopsticks, imitated Qin Yang's appearance, and put it in his mouth to chew it vigorously. In no time, the four dishes and one soup were swept away by the two of them. Duan Yu is still somewhat reserved, so most of them were eliminated by Qin Yang. A pot of wine was also consumed by the two of them. Having had enough to eat and drink, Qin Yang spread out on the chair and took a deep breath. Ah, it's great. It's been a long time since I had such a great time eating. Watching Qin Yang's appearance, Duan Yu burst into laughter. So this way of eating is so refreshing. If it weren't for the young master, I wouldn't have known. Duan Yu also ate very well. And at this incredibly comfortable moment, an untimely shout shattered this rare realm. Crane in the clouds. You can't run anymore. With a loud shout, everyone dispersed in fear. Subsequently, a few officers and soldiers surrounded in a grand manner. The leader is actually a woman. Chapter 005 The Four Great Villains, Crane in the Clouds You are listening at NovelFull.audio Surprisingly, it's a crane in the clouds. Another celebrity has arrived. As one of the four famous villains in the Tianlong Eight Tribes, Chen Yang naturally knows. This crane in the clouds is known as, extremely vicious, but it is definitely a lecherous person. I saw that the crane in the clouds was extremely tall and thin, standing like a hemp pole. Especially with a face that looks like a ghost. Undoubtedly, he is one of the four great villains. His image, figure, and direction truly deserve his title of extreme evil. Duan Yu has also heard of the famous crane in the clouds, and he never expected to see these four villains here. Zhang Hongling, you've been chasing me for five days now. I'm not fighting back, I'm just giving face to six gates. Don't think I'm afraid of you. If you turn around now and leave, I will let bygones be bygones. If not, don't blame me for being impolite. Faced with Zhang Hongling tightly biting and not letting go, Yun Hong was extremely angry and had already endured to the extreme. As one of the four notorious villains, when did he ever hold back so much? Unexpectedly being chased by a young lady like this. As the news spread, his face, like a crane in the clouds, shifted towards that. Since it's impossible to shake it off no matter how hard it is, it's also impossible for him to be captured with his hands tied up. Then we can only do it. Zhang Hongling, the constable of the Six Doors, is the second miss of the Kaifeng Zhan family. She is incredibly beautiful. She is a famous beauty in the martial arts world. The Acquired Realm With the character and strength of a crane in the clouds, if it weren't for being afraid of the Six Gates, this little girl would have ended long ago. Humph. Zhang Hongling let out a heavy snort. Crane in the clouds, you have harmed a young girl. Today, no matter where I chase you to the ends of the earth, I will also arrest you and bring you to justice. With Zhang Hongling's jealous nature, it is impossible for such a great villain as Yun Zhanghe to be left unattended. Especially, this crane in the clouds actually committed a crime under his nose. Unforgivable. The crane in the clouds laughed back in anger. A clumsy guy. Okay, today I'll ask you what skills you have to capture me and bring me to justice. After speaking, I didn't wait for Zhan Hongling to react. A pair of iron-clawed steel bars used eight strikes of cranes and snakes to grab Zhan Hongling. The claws made of refined steel sparkle with cold light. The body method is eerie and incredibly fast. Before the claws arrived, the strong energy oppressed Zhan Hongling and she couldn't catch her breath. 
Zhan Hongling had a solemn expression on her face, her silver teeth clenched tightly. With a solemn expression, he pulled out the judge's pen and got into a fight in front of him. Boom! Attack and defend. Strong energy leaked out from the side, and the table next to it seemed to be shattered by a bomb. Zhan Hongling was also thrown upside down by the powerful force and fell heavily to the ground. This crane in the clouds is worthy of being one of the four great villains, incredibly powerful. With just one blow, it suppressed Zhan Hongling. You should know that Zhan Hongling is not just about her beautiful appearance. In the realm of postnatal cultivation, he is also a renowned expert. Countless thieves were caught. Now I can't withstand the strike of the crane in the clouds. After a single blow, there was no sound around. The officers and soldiers surrounding the crane in the clouds were so frightened that they held steel knives in their hands, but in a fierce battle, no one dared to take a step forward. Ha ha ha, little girl, now you know the master's strength. The crane in the clouds laughed arrogantly. I wanted to let you go, but you didn't know what to do. Now the master can only reluctantly carry it home and enjoy it well. I don't know how the body of this female constable differs from that of an ordinary woman. As he spoke, the crane in the clouds smirked and walked leisurely towards Zhan Hongling. Startled by the powerful aura of the crane in the clouds, no one dared to stop the surrounding officers and soldiers, as well as the surrounding martial arts heroes. A tragic event of annihilating humanity is about to occur. At this moment, Amitbha Buddha. The sudden appearance of a Buddhist horn shattered the tranquility. Chen Yang, who was standing by, watched a great show for half a day. At this critical moment, Chen Yang couldn't bear to let such a beautiful Zhan Hongling be ruined by a crane in the clouds. This benefactor, please stop. Chen Yang held a Zen cane in his hand. Place one hand on the chest to perform Buddhist rituals. My Buddha is merciful. Please do not act recklessly here, benefactor. Faced with the powerful aura of a crane in the clouds, Chen Yang Baoxiang exuded dignity and composure. The Zen cane reflects golden light under the sunlight. Set off Chen Yang's somewhat ethereal aura. He looks like a virtuous monk. If it weren't for the overly youthful face, the crane in the clouds would have believed it. Little monk, there's no room for you to intervene here. While the master is happy, hurry back to your dilapidated temple and recite your scriptures. Otherwise, hum, I'll take you down with one paw and send you directly to see the Buddha. Don't learn from others' heroes to save beauty, but risk your life. The crane in the clouds disdainfully said. A little monk and nun. Put it on and pretend to be a big-tailed wolf. If those old bald donkeys with white beards and hair, the crane in the clouds may still weigh it. Little master, don't be impulsive. Duan you on the side quickly and quietly tugged at Chen Yang. This crane in the clouds is an innate expert, even I dare not say that I can definitely defeat him. It's not easy to encounter such an interesting little master. The officers and soldiers around also showed signs of unbearable expression. But asking them to come forward and help seems to lack the courage. Chapter 006 Mighty Heavenly Dragon, Dala Dharma Mantra, Prajnaparamita You are listening at Novel Full Audio. Chen Yang lightly patted Duan Yu's hand. Gave him a calm gaze. Signaled him to be calm and not impatient. It's just a crane in the clouds, Chen Yang hasn't noticed it yet. Amitbha Buddha. Almsgiver, your sins are too heavy, and you will go to hell after death. Chen Yang Baoxiang has dignity and a serious face. But, there is a virtue of good life in heaven. If you put down your butcher's knife now, benefactor. Practice with the poor monk for another ten or twenty years, and do more good deeds eating fast and chanting Buddha every day. There is still a chance to wash away the sins of the donor and go to the western paradise. I, Buddha, have saved all sentient beings and left you wicked people with opportunities. Chen Yang spoke persuasive words, but his expression changed from serious to joking. 
Even if the crane in the clouds wants to surrender and follow him, he still doesn't want it. He looks so ugly, looking at such a thing every day, how annoying it is. You see how beautiful their red silk is. The crane in the clouds is so grown that it dares to come out and sway. It's not just disgusting, it's simply disgusting. Disgusting. Bald donkey, noisy. The crane in the clouds is furious. Go to your damn west, seek death. Western paradise, isn't that just death? The crane in the clouds shouted and cursed loudly, and Chen Yang's seven orifices were filled with smoke. Raising his iron claws in his hand, he looked like a ghost and even took the initiative to attack. Little master. Little monk. Don't do it. Duan Yu and Zhan Hongling drank loudly together. Do they know Chen Yang's level of martial arts? But they have just experienced the strength of the crane in the clouds. The innate realm is also a first dot class expert in the martial arts world. With just one strike, Zhan Hongling lay motionless on the ground. How dare Chen Yang go and seek death? I can't stop seeing it. Duan Yu became more solemn. Lift both fingers together and move internal forces. Now we have to fight to the death. Zhang Hongling gritted her teeth and struggled to get up from the ground. Grasp the judge's pen tightly in your hand and use your internal strength regardless of the injury. He summoned the crane in the clouds, and Chen Yang also came to save him. Both in terms of emotion and reason, he cannot let Chen Yang stand in front of him. Even if it cannot be defeated. Even if the meridians are broken, we must protect Chen Yang. At least save his life. Amitba Buddha. Chen Yang saw the Yunzhong who had come to kill him promptly proclaim the Buddha's name in the second mouth. This time, he used his internal power to bless it. The sound is like a grand bell, solemn and heavy. The expression also became solemn. Benefactor, you are still stubborn and ineffective to this point. Today, I will treat you well for my Buddha. Ha, bold demon, I can tell at a glance that you're not a human. Don't show the prototype yet. Chen Yang's one-handed pinching technique, using the powerful heavenly dragon technique. As the Dharma decision changed, a golden Buddha light appeared in the palm of the hand. Reflecting the delicate face of Chen Yang. Chen Yang automatically generated a dedicated BGM with his brain. De Wei Tian Long. De Wei Tian Long, the Luo Fa mantra, Prajnaparamita Buddhas, Prajnaparamita Bama Bang. Humph. A small skill like carving insects, how dare you teach others how to wield an axe? A mighty dragon. A powerful force blew Chen Yang's monk robe. Chen Yang pinches the formula in one hand and sticks in the other. With the blessing of Buddha's light, he looks like a arhat. Boom! Chen Yang had an early innate cultivation, and with the blessing of the powerful heavenly dragon technique, he even exerted an innate and complete pressure. The powerful aura suppressed the entire restaurant. Everyone's hearts trembled. The aura of innate perfection is revealed. The crane in the cloud was pressed down and breathed rapidly, unable to catch its breath. The figure froze for a moment. How could it be? Duan Yu, Zhang Hongling, and Yun Zhanghi were both shocked in their hearts. This little monk is actually an innate and perfect existence. It's too scary. How old Chen Yang is? Looking at the age of only 15 or 16 at most. At such a young age, it is already an innate realm. Will it be okay in the future? What about being innate? The crane in the clouds remained calm and composed, squeezing out a sentence from its dry throat. Nowadays, the crane in the clouds is difficult to dismount while riding a tiger. What about being innate? The crane in the clouds increased its volume, used its internal strength, and shouted loudly. I still. Pop. A crisp slap imprinted on the face of the crane in the clouds. Chen Yang's Buddha light burst out of his hand, directly dispersing his accumulated internal strength. The crane in the clouds was directly blinded. You. 
The crane in the clouds was furious and stirred up internal energy in the second attempt. Pop. Chen Yang slapped again. I'll fight with you. Pop. Ah, uh, seeking death. Pop. Ah, uh, no. Pop. No, sob. With a rhythmic crackling sound. In front of Chen Yang's powerful internal strength, Yun Zhanghe surprisingly had no strength to fight back. Just holding iron claws to protect his face. But under the suppression of Chen Yang's realm, it was of no use at all. I slapped it a few times. In no time, Yun Zhanghe's head had been beaten into a pig's head by Chen Yang. Not long ago, the mighty crane in the clouds was slapped and cried by Chen Yang. Now his mother can't recognize the crane in the cloud. Previously, she was extremely arrogant and invincible, but now when Chen Yang slaps her, the crane in the clouds directly turns into a resentful woman in a deep boudoir. What a bully! What a bully! How can one hit someone in the face? Chapter 007 Successfully Transforming an Evil Person, Rewarding Accumulation You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Looking at Chen Yang, who was incredibly powerful, Duan Yu and Zhang Hongling were completely bewildered. Is this really a monk? Isn't it true that monks value compassion? This is too violent. Although it's about dealing with the wicked. This is a great good thing that brings joy and prosperity. But this method really doesn't seem like it was done by a monk at all. In their impression, aren't monks always convincing people with reason and transforming evil people? Now I see Chen Yang pulling at the collar of the crane in the clouds and slapping his face although it feels great the difference from Chen Yang's previous portrayal of being a high monk is too great. Just like, like a little thug on the street. Chen Yang played for a while, feeling a bit tired. I just stopped my hand. Well, not bad, the area of the face is two circles larger than before. Chen Yang admired his masterpiece and felt a sense of relief. Although hitting someone like this is not elegant and undermines his image as a Taoist monk. But it's so satisfying to hit someone like this. That's really cool. After finishing the fight, Chen Yang felt comfortable all over his body. Chen Yang adjusted the entire monk's robe. He has regained his image as a virtuous monk. Have you taken it? After organizing, Chen Yang stared at the crane in the clouds and asked softly. Served. The crane in the clouds left tears of emotion at the corner of its eyes and spoke vaguely. My teeth have all been knocked out, and my face is swollen and deformed. No one dares to have any reason to disagree. I dare not do evil again in the future. No matter, dare, no matter, dare. The words have just finished. Ding. Congratulations to the master for successfully transforming a villain. Reward points. 100 points, one lucky draw is allowed. At this point, the system has a prompt. Can it still be like this? To turn evil into evil, give points. Can I draw a lottery if I score 100 points? Since the system gave him his first reward, there has been no movement. Now, Chen Yang has finally found the usefulness of the system. Well, not bad, not bad. Transforming evil people is exactly what Chen Yang likes to do. Chen Yang refers to physicalization. This is a beneficial thing for both physical and mental health. Cleaning up pests is beneficial for both the country and the people. Now, based on the experimental product of Yunzhong, this road is accessible. And the effect is really good. High efficiency and good results. As for whether you truly regret it or not, will you repeat it in the future? Chen Yang is clear that for a lifetime of wrongdoing, a single beating is obviously irreversible. However, if you make a mistake, go catch it again. If you catch it, give it another beating. There is no villain that cannot be solved in one fight. If it is not enough, let's do it again. As for ideological transformation. Chen Yang said that whenever there is time, he can find several villains to fight against. 
Constable Zhang, I have something to ask you for. Seeing that Zhang Hongling had already crossed her knees to recuperate and rest, she stood up. Chen Yang stepped forward and said. Little master, you don't need to be polite. You saved my life, not to mention one thing, I promise to do a hundred things. Then make a promise with your own life. Chen Yang looked at John Hongling's rosy face due to some injuries. It's easy to speak up. Amitba Buddha. I am a righteous monk, how can we take advantage of someone's situation? However, if Chen Yang demands it now, perhaps there is still some chance of winning. The premise is that if he weren't a monk, Amitba Buddha, sin and sin. Female benefactor, it's like this. I have to go to Wudang to complete the task assigned to me by my master. So, I can't balance this villain anymore. So I want to hand it over to the female donor. However, female benefactor, rest assured that I have already sealed his eight extraordinary meridians. Within a week, he won't be able to use his true energy recklessly. I think there will be enough time for the female benefactor to send him back to the six doors in one week. Chen Yang arranged the crane in the clouds properly. I believe that as long as Yunzhong enters the six gates, the six gates can make Yunzhong cuisine clear and understandable. There's no problem with this, it's all what I should do. Little master, please rest assured to hand it over to me. However, I haven't asked the young master where to practice yet. If there is a chance in the future, I will definitely repay the young master. Seeing Chen Yang's intention to leave, John Hongling quickly said. There's no need to say anything in return. I am just an ordinary little monk and nun on Shaoshir Mountain, with the Dharma name Fahai, which is not worth mentioning. Fahai. Shaolin Temple Disciple. John Hongling was puzzled. Why have you never heard of this person in the martial arts world? With such skill, this person comes from a martial arts school like Shaolin Temple. Shouldn't it be silent and nameless? Chen Yang saw Zhang Hongling's confusion. I won't explain much either. Find a rope and trap the crane in the clouds into a caterpillar. Hand it over to Zhang Hongling. I performed a Buddhist ritual. Amitba Buddha, benefactor, I will bid farewell here. Seeing Chen Yang about to leave, the officers and soldiers, as well as the diners of the restaurant, also stepped forward one after another. Bowing or bowing, expressing gratitude. Chen Yang waved his hand lightly, indicating that there was no need to be polite. Please don't be infatuated with brother, he is just a legend. Kill one person in ten steps, leaving no trace for a thousand miles. Amidst the revered gaze of the crowd, Chen Yang left the restaurant. Chapter 008 This Jianghu is very big, waiting for me to conquer it. You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chen Yang had just walked out of the restaurant when a voice came from behind. Little master, wait a moment. It's actually Duan Yu. Benefactor Duan. What can I do for you? Looking at Duan Yu chasing him out of the restaurant, Chen Yang asked in confusion. Ah, uh, um. In fact, there was nothing wrong with Duan Yu coming out this time. Now seeing Chen Yang, I am deeply attracted to him. Not only Chen Yang is an interesting person. Moreover, Duan Yu felt a sensation from Chen Yang that he had never experienced before. That is a feeling of equality. From childhood to adulthood, everyone Duan Yu met was flattery. This feeling of equal coexistence has never been felt by Duan Yu. This makes Duan Yu feel very comfortable. Well, I heard that the young master is going to Wudang Mountain, and I happen to want to go too. Why don't we go together? It's better to have some care on the way. Along with Duan Yu, Chen Yang is indispensable. I even have some expectations. Duan Yu is a reliable son of good luck. I feel a little excited to go on the road with him. And as Chen Yang left, the diners in the restaurant are still discussing what happened just now. It is said that Chen Yang is a personal disciple of the abbot of Shaolin Temple. 
It is said that Chen Yang is an old monster who returns to life and plays in the world. The more it spreads, the more evil it becomes. As Zhan Hongling watched Chen Yang leave, she was somewhat reluctant. Although the time spent together is only a short meal. But Chen Yang's figure was deeply imprinted in Zhan Hongling's heart. Thinking and thinking, I don't know what came to mind. Zhan Hongling's pale face suddenly showed a blush. Subsequently, Zhan Hongling quickly stopped. Let's go, we need to go back to the Yaman and report this matter first. Zhan Hongling's voice became cold. Glancing around at the officers and soldiers. Yes, yes. The officers and soldiers awkwardly responded. Previously, they stood idly by when facing the crane in the clouds. Although there is an absolute gap in strength as a fact. They didn't make a move, and the result was the same. However, such an approach would ultimately be morally detrimental. At this moment, the crane in the clouds was disheartened and remained silent. It's like losing one's soul. What happened today dealt a great blow to him. It simply subverts his three views. A little doll rubbed him, a senior in the martial arts world, onto the ground. In no time, everyone disappeared into the vast sea of people. No matter what the future holds for the crane in the clouds. At this moment, on the way to Wudang Mountain. I have a question below. With the cultivation of the young master, why didn't you make it to the green dragon list? Duan Yu witnessed Chen Yang's strength with his own eyes. Among the younger generation, they are definitely among the top two. Absolutely capable of making it to the green dragon list. Green dragon list. Chen Yang was puzzled by Duan Yu's inquiry. What is the green dragon list? Why do I have to fuck him? Qing Long list, little master doesn't even know. Later, Duan Yu was relieved. Yes, based on the master's cultivation level, it must be crucial to practice all day long. Without waiting for Chen Yang to explain, Duan Yu automatically brainstormed the reason. There's no other leisure time to learn about these. Then I'll introduce one or two to you, young master. With Duan Yu's words, Chen Yang understood. Originally, there were not only the green dragon list. In addition, there are also the three rankings of heaven, earth, and man. And these lists were all created by a martial arts expert. It is a recognized authoritative ranking in the martial arts world. Every list is not something that ordinary people can enter. Among them. The heavenly list records the experts in the heavenly and human realm. The record of the land list is that of great masters and experts. The person list is a record of the master realm experts. The Qing Long list is a separate list. Only record young heroes under the age of 20 in the martial arts world. Every famous member of the gang has unparalleled strength. Being able to make it to this list is an unparalleled honor and can definitely be called a hero. It can be boasted about for a lifetime. On the list, at the very least, it also depends on the acquired realm. The innate realm is even more abundant. Besides that, this Jianghu Bai Shaoxing has also compiled lists such as the Divine Weapon List, the Ultimate Beauty List, the power list, and so on. Based solely on these rankings, the reputation of the hundred Shaoxing in the martial arts world is definitely worthy of its name. I see. After listening to Duan Yu's introduction, Chen Yang understood. This Jianghu is quite lively. As for being on the list or something, Chen Yang naturally understands why. I jumped from a second or third rate cultivation to an early innate stage in just one night. Moreover, he obtained the powerful heavenly dragon technique. The combat power soared like a rocket soaring into the sky. Not to mention being a hundred Shaoxing in the Jianghu, but also a thousand Shaoxing, one Shaoxing, I'm afraid he knows his strength at this moment. The only person who feels the deepest about Qin Yang's strength nowadays is probably a crane in the clouds. I don't care whether it's on the list or not. It's a bit interesting in this world of martial arts. Chen Yang sighed at Duan Yu. Yeah. 
I only found out after coming out that the world is so vast. Let's go, we still have to hurry. The world is vast, but Chen Yang has great potential. Chapter 009 Tianji Pavilion, The Day of Release You are listening at NovelFull.audio At this moment, as Chen Yang and Duan Yu leisurely advanced towards Wudang. In the martial arts world. A mysterious place. A large architectural complex. Many people are busy going in and out. This is the Tianji Pavilion created by Bai Shaoxing in the martial arts world. The moon has appeared slightly, and a silver light is scattered. A sturdy messenger carrying an arrow galloped over on a fast horse. Urgent, urgent. The messenger shouted all the way. Seeing the situation at the secret whistle in the dark, I dare not stop it. The gatekeepers on duty also hurriedly cleared the way. The messenger ran all the way. Walk through corridors and pavilions. In no time, he arrived in front of a small cabin. The small house in front of me is only two meters tall and four or five meters wide. Compared to the surrounding buildings, it is inconspicuous at all. Even somewhat dilapidated. It's more like a toilet than a cabin. The location is also quite secretive. Even if you don't pay attention, you will overlook the past. But the messenger knew that in front of this inconspicuous cabin. Ambush countless skilled guards day and night. If anyone wants to cause destruction here, they probably don't even know how to die. When the messenger arrived a hundred steps away from here, he flipped over and dismounted. Taking out a red letter from his arms, he bowed and respectfully walked to the front of the house. Dang dang, dang dang, dang dang, dang. Rhythmically tapping on the wooden door of the cabin. The door opens. The messenger dared not even lift his head. Xu Tu carefully placed the letter into the central letter box inside the house. Then, with a heavy head, he retreated out of the cabin. After leaving the cabin, he bowed to the surroundings again. The messenger knew that the guards in secret were all experts who were more powerful than him. It wasn't until the next turn that the messenger finally breathed a sigh of relief. It can be considered as completing the task. Fortunately, everything went smoothly without any mistakes. And just as the messenger put down the red letter, the mechanism inside the letter box is instantly activated. Under a series of complex institutional operations. In no time, the letter was delivered to an old man in red. The old man held the letter and placed it under the candle, carefully examining it. Then, carefully caress with both hands. This is when I opened the letter. The old man looked at ten lines at a glance, and in no time, he finished reading the short message in the letter. But after reading it, the old man froze and held the letter for a long time without putting it down. Is the information above true? The old man carefully checked the letter again, that's right. This is true. It's been a long time since I saw such a letter. This world is becoming increasingly interesting. Then, the old man picked up a brush and pondered for a while. Shua 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 wrote a few big characters on the letter again. Then he handed it over and placed it in a box next to him. Tianji Tower Created by Tianji Pavilion Today, it's particularly lively in front of Tianji Tower. Many people in the martial arts world have been waiting here for a long time. Because today is the day for the update of the Qinglong list. This Qinglong list is only updated once a month, every time it's updated. This day, such a prosperous situation will appear in front of the machine building. Brother Wang, did you come so early? A short and chubby boy chuckled and said. Yeah, yes, it turned out to be brotherly. The person saw the chubby little man in front of him without any sense of indifference. He understands that despite his simple and honest appearance, this chubby little guy is actually a ruthless character. Not to mention his family background, he himself is also a ruthless master. I heard that Brother Lee successfully broke through the post-apocalyptic realm, and even more recently, he successfully challenged the South Mountain Twin Heroes alone. 
This ranking is very promising. The little chubby man squinted his eyes and laughed. Where and where, compared to the Tianjiao on the list, it's just a small matter. On the contrary, Brother Wan, has it been six months since he broke through the later stage of the day after tomorrow? Is there any improvement in cultivation now? The person quickly echoed back. I'm ashamed, I also got stuck for quite some time in the later stage of the day after tomorrow. Just half a month ago, I was lucky enough to break through, and now I have reached the perfect state the day after tomorrow. Even. Congratulations to Brother Wang, he's really on the list this time. That person is even more respectful this time. This chubby little guy has a bright future ahead of him. He needs to give this thigh a good hug. Here we go. Seeing a warrior appear on a wooden board in front of the building, everyone fell silent. As the samurai pulled out a list woven from gold thread, everyone's attention focused on it. Shua. The list opened, and everyone stretched their necks. See if there's me. Wipe it off, I didn't even make it. How could Murong Chong make it onto the list? I'm going to seek advice from Murong Chong and see what skills he has to make it to the list. A strong man saw the list and angrily grabbed an axe and left. It seems that this person and that Murong Chong are going to be unlucky. And just before this list, such things are everywhere. Some people envy, some envy, some are proud, and some are dissatisfied. Brother Wang, Brother Wang, you're on the list. Seeing that the chubby guy really made it to the list, the person quickly congratulated him. It's just the 500th place, just barely strong, not worth mentioning. Although the chubby little man said so, he was actually overjoyed in his heart. Now, even when he goes out, he can say that he is a famous generation of Tianjiao on the Qinglong list. It's not in vain for him to put in a lot of effort and pile up various resources. Now there has finally been some reward. Chapter 010 Qinglong List, 100th Place, Shaolin Fahai You are listening at NovelFull.audio Eh. Are you looking at the changes in the top 100 on the Qinglong List? Suddenly someone shouted loudly. In an instant. All the people in the martial arts world looked towards the position of which hundred, and indeed found that the name that was originally occupied by the four shows of Qingqing had changed. Qingqing Sishou can be considered as the recent talents of the Qingqing sect. The four of them joined forces to climb to the 100th place on the Qinglong list, which can be considered as giving the Qingqing sect a long face. But it wasn't long before I was pushed down by someone. This is big news. You should know that the position of the first 100 has not changed for several months. For a moment, everyone looked at the position of 100 to see which martial arts hero was on the list. 100th place. Name. Fahai origin. Suspected of Shaolin cultivation. Early congenital stage age. 15 achievements. Defeat the four evil men Yun Zhanghi in the early days with one move. This. The martial arts experts present were simply stunned. Who is this? I've never heard of it before. And, defeating the crane in the clouds with one move, what kind of combat power is this, so powerful? Someone said in confusion. This person was not on the Qinglong list before. The little chubby man, who was extremely familiar with the Qinglong list, stared wide and murmured. What, not before? Can you say? Surprisingly, this person ranks in the top 100 as soon as he enters the list. What kind of monster is this? You should know that this Qinglong list has gathered the vast majority of young people with potential in the martial arts world. Generally speaking, it's the first time to make it to the list, and then move forward bit by bit until you have a good reputation before appearing in the top 100 of the list. How can someone now directly enter the top 100? Yeah, and besides, this person's age is only 15 years old. The chubby little boy suddenly felt that entering the top 500 on the Green Dragon list was no longer popular. The tone carries a hint of sourness. 
the chubby boy asked himself about his family background, talent, diligence, scheming, and IQ. I am not inferior to others. Moreover, he has always been one step ahead of his peers. Now, he has even entered the Green Dragon list and become a famous and sexual pride in the entire martial arts world. But now, it has been severely hit. A silent and nameless person, upon leaving the mountain, defeated Yunzhong, one of the four evil men in the martial arts world, and climbed to the top 100 on the Green Dragon list. These grades. Just throw yourself far away and straight into the blue clouds. His mother, he's several years younger than himself. Where can I make sense of this? He is not the only one like this, many young people present are the same. At the age of 15, they are born in the early stages, and this is simply a monster. The last time such a situation occurred was when there were no shortage of flowers in the moving flower palace. I didn't expect such a person to appear again this time. With the release of the Qinglong list, the information on the list has also reached the hands of major forces in the martial arts world through various channels. And the name Fa Hai has spread to various forces in the martial arts world. Shaolin Temple Abbot, the Green Dragon list has been released today. A Shaolin elder stood respectfully on one side and whispered. The abbot of Shaolin Temple stopped meditating and slowly opened his eyes. Hmm, is there any Shaolin disciple on the list? Kong Jian nature refers to the newly listed disciples within the past month. Although Buddhism emphasizes the six emptiness, there is still a trace of desire, after all, no one can truly achieve no desire or desire. After all, as a major sect in the martial arts world, Shaolin Temple has abundant resources and numerous disciples. Among them, there are also geniuses. There are still some on the Green Dragon list. There is one person on the list who is suspected to be a Shaolin disciple. Occasionally. Is there such a thing as Shaolin disciples who can't even predict the Tianji Pavilion? This can't be blamed on Tianji Pavilion, it's really Chen Yang's promotion too fast. I used to be an unknown person and never entered the field of vision of Tianji Pavilion. What is this person's name and where did they rank? Fahai, ranked 100th. What, the 100th place? Go straight to the 100th place. The abbot is not calm anymore, this is rare. Bring it to me for a look. The disciple quickly handed over the list in his hand to the abbot. The abbot carefully examined, but the more he looked, the more confused he became. This person's ability to directly reach the top 100 on the Green Dragon list indicates that they are a person of extraordinary talent. In theory, these disciples are the core disciples that are highly valued in the temple. However, why don't I remember this Fahai? When did my Shaolin temple produce such disciples? As a person in charge of one of the top sects in the martial arts world, the abbot of Shaolin Temple was directly made to doubt his ability by this sea of magic.